All right, what's going on YouTube? Card Collector 2 coming at you here with a brand new video. And today we are back to record another PC video. This time it will be part one of a two part series showcasing the top 100 Ohio State cards in my personal collection. So we've actually done this video before, but this has been quite a while since we've done this. So I figured this would be a nice look at an updated Ohio State PC. So I grew up in Columbus. Ohio State, especially Ohio State football, is really my pride and joy. It's something I enjoy um, watching when they're on, going to games, and of course collecting their cards. Um, again, growing up in Columbus and being a Buckeye fan and now a full-time sports card collector, uh, dealer, shop owner, etc. Um, collecting this kind of stuff is really what I enjoy most. So we are going to show you the top 100 cards. This was definitely hard. We could have picked out really quite a bit of stuff. Um, we'll likely show a Donnie Nicky video here soon, as well as a Braxton Miller video, uh, both for PCs. So it does. This video is not going to include a lot of those guys. As those are really two uh, two of my main PCs. So I wanted to showcase some of the other stuff we've got. We will start at a hundred and work our way down. Um, some of these work kind of hard to figure out the difference. If this is card number forty five or card number forty six, um, but I think we've got a pretty good breakdown of that. So we want to start with some honorable mentions. This is actually a gift um, from a friend. It is a custom one of one. Uh, shout out to Connor's Cards for this. He collects offensive linemen. He actually made this for us. Uh, Jim Lachey was an Ohio State All-American offensive guard back in the day. Played in the NFL. Um, I don't know if he won a Super Bowl, but it says Super Bowl. Um, so maybe he won it. That I don't know, but I know he's one of the radio analysts for Ohio State now. So that's kind of cool. I love custom cards like that. You actually see one in the video, um, probably part two. And then these are college tribute patches. Upper Deck used to make these back in the day. Um, I don't have all of them. Would love to be able to collect uh, or pick up all of these in the future. But you've got a couple of the Skull Sessions. Um, these are like really some of my favorite cards. They're not worth much, but again, just uh, being an Ohio State fan, this stuff I just love. Got a Buckeye helmet sticker. And then probably my favorite place on earth, Ohio Stadium, the Horseshoe. Um, nothing in the world for me like like being there. Uh, truly, truly uh, just, I love it. You guys know that if you guys have followed us on YouTube or IG for a while. Being inside the Horseshoe, like I said, there's just nothing like it. All right, so those are honorable mentions. Let's get into it. So starting at 100, we're going to keep these three together. Uh, so these are CJ Strouds. So these are from Leaf All-American. So you've got two patch autos and you've got a blue auto. Seven of 20 here, seven of 15 here. I actually picked these up before the start of the season when I saw his practice jersey, and I don't think it was clear what number he was gonna wear. So I picked up some stuff that was seven, ended up being that. You guys know I collected jersey numbered stuff. Uh, these might move up in time, but at the moment, Stroud has not really done anything for Ohio State yet. I think he will, and I think he'll be uh, one of the all-time guys for Ohio State, but until then, just can't put him anywhere any higher than this, but figured we would uh, we'd put him at spot 100. Then, again, another thing we're going to try to keep together, this would be 99. I have five Kata Bates Diops Cracked Dice. You guys know Cracked Dice is my thing, especially the college stuff. Kata, Big Ten Player of the Year is last year at Ohio State. Uh, Holtman's first year, I believe, uh, but I was able to acquire five of the 23 Cracked Dice. Next up, another pair. These will be our only pairings um, this entire video series. We got two Billy Price, both one of one contenders, rookie autos, um, the variation and the base. All right, moving on, Paris Campbell, five of five patch auto. You'll see a lot of this, the NTs, the flawless, the immaculates, the college stuff, the patch autos of the Buckeyes I grew up watching. Um, some won national titles, others for beating Michigan. A um, lot of different reasons, but this is the kind of stuff you guys will see a lot of. More patches here, also from the PlayStation Fiesta Bowl 5 of 5. And 2 of 5 Paris Campbell as well. Same Fiesta Bowl patch. Then Michael Red. Uh, actually had the pleasure of meeting him recently. Um, super nice guy. Game used jersey number patch. One of the best Ohio State basketball players of all time. Um, a game used jumbo patch with the number piece. Just can't beat that. Then you got Johnny Dixon, one of my all-time favorite Buckeyes. Um, I remember shooting him some DMs and he would always respond. Really, really nice guy. 
Uh, one of the guys I hope to get a game used jersey of at some point was never really the, the best Buckeye ever, um, but just humble dude down to earth. So uh, th this is cool. Again, Prism Draft. Prism and Contenders probably my favorite things to collect. You guys will see plenty of that. Uh, Bosa Brothers, College Ties, Dual Auto at a 15. Uh, two of the all-time guys at Ohio State for defensive ends. Uh, another one you don't see. This is actually a gift. You don't see these too often. Shout out to Nick for the gift. At a 24 or a 25 red refractor, AJ Hawk Tops Chrome Rookie. This is right when I got into cards, 2006. So just a cool piece. And then again, another Michael Red Patch Auto Exquisite. Uh, game used. One of the all-time basketball products for uh, anything basketball. Again, Exquisite out of 100 game used Patch Auto. So that is the first 10. Moving on. Another Kata Bates Diop, black, one of one optic, another card that was actually a gift. Then you've got a Cardale Jones, one of one rookie roundup, national title winning quarterback. Didn't ever do much in the pros, um, but won a national title at Ohio State, the first ever college football playoff. Beat Alabama, Oregon, Wisconsin, just that three game stretch was probably the best three game stretch in my Ohio State lifetime. Uh, Cardale, one of one origins, patch auto, or patch. The next two cards, you got a Cardell Jones printing plate, one of one. This is from 2016, so this is a rookie, and it is also game worn. You can see that. Love the game worn stuff. Continuing on that, that's the printing plate. This is the base one of one. So base one of one Cardell patch, game worn, game worn college patch of a national title winning quarterback. That's that's as good as it gets right there. Um, Denzel Ward. This is a gift from my guy Dom, uh, one of one. Black PSA 9 from Panini Honors. Uh, Michael Thomas logo patch from Immaculate Rookie Auto. Pretty sick Saints logo there. And you got a Sam Hubbard. It's actually a highly re uh, high ranked recruit for lacrosse in high school from St. X. 101. Uh, another 101, Paris Campbell, legacy rookie. Another card that was actually a gift. And then a Denzel Ward Gold Vinyl 9.5 Rated Rookie 1 of 1. All right, moving along. No top 100 Buckeye PC would be complete without one of the greats. Eddie George on card exquisite auto out of six. Uh, Heisman Trophy. Disappointing they never won a national title. Some of those late 90s teams were stacked. Um, unfortunately, John Cooper was oftentimes not able to... Uh, Win some of the big games, the Michigan games, just things like that. Um, but Eddie was an all-time guy. Both college and pros, actually. Probably one of the best Buckeyes for college and pro. Uh, up there with like Orlando Pace and uh, a couple other guys. All right, now you'll see a big stretch of these right here. Contenders draft picks. Again, I talk about that a lot. The championship ticket, one of one autos from the Buckeyes in their college uniform. Those in the Prism Draft 101 rookies and autos are some of my favorite things in the entire world to collect. I try to get as many as I can. Here's one of them. There's uh, Marcus Ball. Tyquan Lewis, defensive end. Jerome Baker, one of one, contenders draft picks auto. Billy Price, one of one. This is my third Billy Price, contenders one of one. This one's in the college, college uniform. Next, another, like I said earlier, my guy, Johnny Dixon, uh, on his prism draft and his contenders draft one of one rookie autos. Uh, another one, probably my favorite Sam Hubbard card in my entire collection, one of one rookie ticket auto, uh, champ ticket from his rookie year. And then KJ Hill, uh, I believe is still the con is the all-time receptions leader for Ohio State in Ohio State history. Some grades that have come through, right? Just to name a couple, David Boston, Terry Glenn, KJ Hill, Michael Thomas, Antonio Holmes, Anthony Gonzalez, McLaurin, uh, you go back, there's Alaves in there now, um, some all-time guys, so KJ Hill, an elite company there. And then a newer pickup, Baron Browning, one of one. I remember uh, when we got him as a recruit, five-star from Texas. Um, thought he would do a little bit more in college, not going to lie, but um, I figured I'd include this in there since it's a newer pickup. All right, we're getting down towards the end. Let's see what we got as we get closer to 50. All right, Scary Terry, Immaculate Rookie Patch Auto, logo one of seven. Um, it's kind of interesting because this is part of the Redskins name, which will, has gone away. 
Um, so be cool because those will uh, not exist here in the future. But Scary Terry, I Black Auto, um, did not expect him to do much in the pros. Uh, his junior year of college dropped a ton of passes. Dude just couldn't catch a cold. Um, and then his, his senior year ended up doing some stuff with Haskins, ended up improving his draft stock. Went to the, the Washington football team and has just excelled as a captain. Is probably a top 10, top 12, 15 receiver in the NFL. So it's just been cool to see him succeed. Very humble guy. Um, so this is, uh, this is pretty cool. Not as cool as this one, though. Another gift from my guy, Tony. Check this out. Again, another piece with the Redskins patch, will not, which will not be there. Uh, one of five. The one thing about this that is cool, the, the Scary Terry, is this is one of seven. Closest thing to jersey number. This is close, one of five, but pretty sick. Check out the patches there. One of five, Scary Terry, Pinini One Rookie Logo Patch Auto. Again, a logo that won't exist in the future. Uh, really one of the more underrated Buckeyes in recent memory. This dude was a stud at Ohio State. Um, huge Malik Hooker fan. I, I just, it's so unfortunate it didn't work out in the NFL. Um, he's still around. I think he was in Dallas. I think he might have got released. Um, man, he was so good. I thought he was going to be like a for sure Hall of Famer. Um, was so good at Ohio State. Just a ball hawk. We got an Optic 101 rookie. Then you've got the Prism 1 of 1 rookie. When Malik came out, I was big on Malik stuff. There's a 1 of 1. Um, and then, of course, got to rank the Buckeye 1 higher. Elite draft picks, die cut rookie, 1 of 1, aqua or light blue. Um, but three 1 of 1 Malik hookers. Again, speaking of all-time guys, Ohio State's linebacking room has uh, not really been the same since these days. Shazier was a stud. Um, Raekwon McMillan wasn't bad. There's There's been some names, but nothing really quite like these guys when it was Hawk, Carpenter, and Schlegel. Uh, that 06 team should have won one of the national titles that lost to LSU and to uh, Urban Meyer's Florida Gators. Uh, but A.J. Hawk and Bobby Carpenter, dual auto. Again, two of the all-time guys in Ohio State history. at Linebacker up there with Kat Samoyer and uh, a couple others, but... A dual auto of two of the greats. And again, that was right when I was getting into cards, right? 06. So I couldn't afford stuff back then like that. Um, so to be able to own that now is just, again, I always say 13-year-old Ryan would be really, really excited we own that. Zeke, uh, one of my favorite Buckeyes all time. Um, th that three-game stretch when we won the national title, Wisconsin, Alabama, Oregon. Look up Zeke's numbers, and they are uh, they're wild. Absolutely wild. Ran through everybody. Um, it's unfortunate we didn't win back-to-back -back in, in, in 15, um, but Zeke wasn't just an animal. Again, talked about it before. The Bosa brothers were uh, definitely something we were missing this year. We had, you know, Joey and then Nick and then Chase Young, and we just didn't have that stud defensive end this year. Um, so this guy, again, just so special at Ohio State. And then, as before we get to 50, we'll leave it with two Braxton Miller cards as we round out the 60s. Got a one-of-one one gold vinyl. I try to keep a lot of my Braxton 101s not in this video um, because, again, that will be a separate video because my Braxton collection is uh, really one of my favorites in all of my PC. But we'll, uh, we'll leave it with Braxton Miller one-of-one one prism black finite right there. Good-looking card. Again, prism, optic. Um, contenders draft that's just really the stuff I just I enjoy collecting so much um, really just what brings me the most joy in, in in collecting all right let's get closer to 50 the final 10 cards in this video again if you guys enjoy the PC videos and have made it this far if you would not mind leaving a thumbs up we're, again we're trying to plan out some videos for 2022 and we want to see what you guys want to see more of leave a thumbs up if you wouldn't mind would greatly greatly appreciate it all right, final 10 cards. Joey Bosa, like I mentioned, just cannot stress it enough, the importance of what he was to Ohio State. Won some big games for us. The Penn State won in overtime. Brings up memories, um, but just truly dominant. Won a national title that matters, right? There's been a lot of great guys recently. Like I said, Chase Young is a name. Fields, Dobbins, some all-time Ohio State guys that didn't win national titles. This guy did. Joey Bosa, national champion. Cracked Ice, again, I've talked about it before. I'll talk about it again. The Cracked Ice Contenders Draft pick stuff of Ohio State guys is my favorite stuff in the entire world to collect. Another national champion and superstar in the NFL. Unfortunately, he didn't play this year. 
Um, not sure what's going on there. Um, but Michael Thomas, cracked ice, rookie ticket auto out of 23. One off his jersey number, but card collector two. We'll go with the lucky number two instead. So Michael Thomas, cracked ice. And then, again, probably one of my all-time favorite Buckeyes, J.K. Dobbins. Uh, J.K. cracked ice 22 of 23. Um, again, as a freshman, just doing so much. It's unfortunate he got hurt the year against Clemson, uh, which I believe we got robbed. Um, but the Clemson game, had he not gotten hurt, could have been a whole different game. Um, not sure we would have beaten Joe Burrow's LSU Tigers that year. They were pretty historic. Um, but a Buckeye legend for sure. Another one, this is actually a gift. Shout out to my man Armin. I got this at the National this year. J.K. Dobbins and K.J. Hill, right? Buckeye greats, dual on-card auto, and it's 2 of 10. Uh, jersey number, J.K. Dobbins. So not only is he one of my favorites, it's also jersey number. I enjoy collecting that stuff. This is like really what I enjoy collecting, that 2 of 10 jersey number on-card autos. This is perfect. So shout out to Armin for that gift there. Then we're getting a little run of Sean Wade. Uh, probably should have went pro after his junior year. Um, would have been a first-round pick that year. Was a stud. Came back. Didn't do much. Dropped tremendously. I think he was a sixth or seventh rounder. Went to the Ravens. Ravens traded him to the Patriots. Um, had one awesome year at Ohio State, and these were super cheap. So, again, I'll pick up cheap one-on-one Buckeye autos for under 100 bucks, typically all day. So grab that. And then next, Sean Wade, one of one Mosaic Auto. Actually picked this up on eBay because of the next card you'll see here in a second. Um, wanted to pair it, but one of one college pro or college jersey auto, black. Definitely, definitely got to have it in the PC. And then this one, this one's higher because I actually pulled this, pulled this out of a box of Mosaic draft picks on our channel earlier this year. Anytime you get to pull a one of one PC card like that, it's kind of a kind of tough to beat. So. Three straight Sean Wade 101 autos in his college uniform. Continuing on with the college 101s, a Draymond Jones 1 of 1 black rookie auto. Um, again, just hard to, I won't, won't, I'll try not to keep repeating it, um, but Paris Campbell would bring up the same argument that 101 Buckeye legend, cheap, not super expensive rookie auto. Um, it's not always about the money. It's not always about um, the value. It's really what, you know, what would you collect if the cards were worth nothing at all? This is the stuff I would collect. So Paris Campbell, one of one Prism draft picks. Um, had a monster game against Michigan one year, Myers last year. Um, wish he would stay healthy in the NFL. That's been disappointing for sure, the fact that he has been unable to stay healthy. Um, but, again, Buckeye, Buckeye great. Um, one of one auto. Oh, oh, no. And then rounding out the first 51 cards in our PC for Ohio State, you've got this guy, Chase Young. So this card's special. I actually picked this up at the National for $4 before Chase Young ever came on the scene. Big fan of the Leaf All-American stuff. I think Leaf does a really good job with this. It'll be interesting to see how this plays out in time with the NIL deals, if Panini will take advantage of that or other companies such as Fanatics in the future will try to capitalize on that. But Leaf has really been one of the ones where you can get upcoming guys like their first ever cards before they ever do anything you'll notice chase young actually uh, signed his full name on this whereas he's basically just cy now because he signs a lot more um, this is before chase young became the predator just dominating and uh dominating ohio state i watched a couple games like i went to the wisconsin game his last year um, really one of the best performances I ever saw. So to be able to get this before he was good for four bucks at the National, the best card show on earth, um, just kind of the story behind it, the memories is, again, why, why I collect. So Chase Young would be card number 51. So that leads us into the next video, which will be dropping hopefully tomorrow, um, our top 50 PS, uh, or PC cards for Ohio State. 1 through 50, we will count them down from 50 to 1. Check it out, guys, but that is all I've got for now. Peace.